breaking news. Nigerians, while I don't shallow. Russia don't want President Bola Metinubu and his ECOWAS member against military intervention in Niger. Constant reviews next move. When they, when they see this thing when they tell President Bola Metinubu about going to war in Niger, you know they hear what? This war not be our war, not be our fight. If France and U.S. won war in Niger, may then send their soldiers go. President Bola Metinubu should leave our soldiers alone. Widows don't do plenty for Nigeria. The one when bandits kill, Boko Haram don't kill. They are widows still dead. You won't still send another set of people, may then go die. For another country, does it worth it? Does it worth it? I beg, make this man listen to waiting, then they talk. You know, no Putin, you know they play with him. He know they play with that man, know they joke. Now, once like this, he don't finish us. How can you go to war with your neighbor? All these people, when they push you, go, go, go. If the Wahala don't come, now we go feel the impact. They're not going to get anything from it. Because you're not going to fed them in any way. The Nigerians then go kill. About five northern states share border with Niger. They intermarry. Then they come out from their backyard, they enter Niger. Niger, they come out from their backyard to see they enter Nigeria. Now you want to go to war. Some refugees, Nigerian refugees, they did it. The other day, some Igbo people, when they did they protest. Don't do this, then they tell you. Main Nigerian government here, listen to the Senate that say, forget about this matter. You know what here? Nigerians, Russian on Friday won't present Bola Tinubu led ECOWAS against a military intervention in Niger Republic. This is coming a day after a West African a leader said they would muster a standby force in their efforts to return President trapped by a, a coup. We believe that a military solution to the crisis in Niger could lead to a protracted confrontation in that African country and to, and to sharp destabilization of the situation in the Sahara Shehe region as a whole, the Russian foreign minister said. <laughs> Una here and so. He said, we can take him again. We believe that a military solution to the crisis in Niger could lead to a protracted confrontation in that African country and to a sharp destabilization of the situation in the Sahara Shehe region as a whole, the Russian foreign minister said. And hear what Nigerians are saying. What I love so much about Russia and Putin is the incontrovertible fact that Russia in the history of the world never colonized any country and that Putin is justice and equity personified. ECOWAS leader seems not to understand that Niger will become the Ukraine of Africa if then, if they venture military into Niger. The spillover effect of such scenario will suffocate eventually all the ECOWAS countries, especially Nigeria. Let us be wise. The price of war hmm, is immeasurable except Nigerian government is looking for something else long life Putin long life Russia the Federation long life Namde Kano long life Simeon Ekpa long life Niger citizens long life Biafra Republic long life Niger Republic long life lovers of freedom all over the world oh my goodness Someone said, I can't wait to watch this movie play. Una want Emmy Locke, all right? Ta, Russia will soon be having two wars. So, I beg, this movie is not an interested one. It's not what anybody can watch. As Nigerian, 
this should be a very big uh, disturbing story you understand to every one of us whether you live in south or you live in north this matter when president bola made tunubu they jump enter because then they push him in no go day sweet at all you understand in no go day sweet at all it's high time these african leaders wake up and do the needful do you think if they are doing well the military will say okay they want to take over because of corruption they are the one causing the problems once they assume office they don't take them to their personal property they don't turn lords they will uh loot money for their 10th generations to come why the masses are dying in our ship and all that they should be beginning to wake up now because life don't they change everything don't they change this is end time everything when god don't talk it don't they come war uh, uh what is it called nation against nation country against country not be like that uh -huh. it did like that for for bible it don't they come to pass you go home money you not go feed use them buy anything because wait till you buy your money, plenty money where you where you hold for for hand, you're not gonna see anything when you buy because of high cost of living. Nigerians, let's see how things unfold. I'm dropping it today. Just kindly share your thoughts below the comment section, please. Do not forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you.